Hello, this is Cameron Rasmussen for GuitarControl.com. So guys, today I'm going to be talking to you about legato picking. Now, legato picking is not really as much picking as it is hammer-ons and pull-offs with your left hand. Your left hand is the bread and butter of legato playing because it's doing most of the work. Now when I say hammer-ons and pull-offs, for those of you who don't know, that's when you literally hammer on or pull off to another note from a note that you've picked. So I'm going to use A and B as my demonstration notes right now. So if I pick A, I'm going to hammer on to B. And if I pick B now, I'm going to pull off to A. Using my left hand to pick every se or to make every second note sound, and I'm not picking every second note. Now the first lick I'm going to show you is only two picks with your right hand, but the rest is all pull-offs with your left hand. And like I said, that's the bread and butter of legato picking. So here we go. And one more time. Alright, now I'm going to play the same kind of pattern uh, for my second example, but it's going to be all hammer-ons. Same picking pattern with your right hand, but all hammer-ons with this hand. And one more time. So with those first two licks I've showed you, they're very useful patterns and you can apply them to any scale or anything that you want to. And your right hand, the way it picks isn't going to change, but your left hand, the positions, the notes that you pick can change, but you can use the exact same um, movement of fingers that I showed you. So instead of doing just this over and over again, or this, you can do this. or you can pull them all off. Now the last lick I'm going to show you is a bit more activity with your right hand for picking wise, um, but it is still a gato plan because the majority is your left hand still pulling off and hammering on every note. So here we go. And I'll play it again. Alright guys, so legato playing is a useful tool to virtually every guitar player that there is, as well are the other picking techniques that I've showed you. So practice them and master them and they won't let you down. Please click the link in the video description if you'd like to see the tab for these examples and I'll see you next time.